Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new, my name is Sierra and welcome to the channel. I hope everybody's doing good and yeah, let's just get started into the video. First things first, let's just address the elephant in the room. My hair, yes, I cut my hair and I'm sorry guys. It wasn't by choice, but I just had to. Um, it was very unhealthy seven inches of unhealthiness around my head. So I needed to get that off. A lot of you might be thinking like, but it was so pretty, it was so long, it was so this, so that, it was so shiny. No, it looked like that from afar, but in actuality, it was pretty dead at the end. New haircut, same Sierra. This is, I guess, the haircut reveal. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys like it. Let me know in the comments what you think. Okay. Second thing, I have an announcement. I did get a P.O. box and here it is, right there. Full screen P.O. box, make sure to screenshot it if you're watching it on your phone. Just take a picture of it or write it down if you're watching it on your TV or whatever else device you may be watching it on. Feel free to send me postcards, letters, we can even pen pals. Uh, feel free to send me a gift if you want to or an item or maybe like you make something I don't know you are creative and you make stuff send it to me if you want to um, You know, it's not a must but definitely nice to get stuff as gifts, you know And also my birthday is coming up. Some people have asked in my latest video. When's my birthday? My birthday is April 6 on Saturday So also you can write that down put it in your calendar set a reminder let your mom know so she can send me food. Yeah. <laughs> Birthday's April 6th, coming up. Two weeks, you have two weeks to send me something. I plan to probably check my mailbox, I wanna say that Friday before. So I'm gonna check the mailbox then and I will actually do a, what do you call it? Unboxing, I will do an unboxing of whatever I get and show the rest of the people. Um, of course, if it's a letter or whatever, I'm not gonna read it. I'll just shout you out. Also, make sure to include like your social media, such as your Instagram handle or whatever, and whatever you send. And I know some of you have been asking and asking and asking me to get a PO box, so I will be expecting something from y'all. Okay, third thing is the giveaway. I'm excited. I have it all uh, pretty much organized. This is how it's gonna work. I have all the lists of people in an Excel document and I have your questions right beside it. So how it's gonna work is I'm going to use a number generator from online and just basically have it generate a number and I believe we have 139 people who entered, which is awesome, like that's a lot of people. Whoever wins will need to email me or also, if you have Instagram, you can also uh, send me a direct message through Instagram, slide into DMs, and let me know your mailing address. It's gonna be a first come, first serve basis. You get to choose which gift card you want. So the person who watches the video the soonest, the person who sends me a message the soonest, will get to choose what gift cards are left. Again, let me just get this right here. Gift cards, we have Target, iTunes, which are both $25, and I actually checked the balance of my Sephora card and it's 30 freaking dollars. That's a good palette, ladies. Pretty excited for you guys. Let's get going with the giveaway. So here is the lovely number generator and my Excel document. As you can see, everybody's names, all the questions, and we have Oh, 132, I thought it was 139. 132 people who have entered. So we're gonna change this to 132. And then it's basically gonna generate a number one through 32 and then that's how it's gonna pick. So we will generate number 127. You are the winner, Yvonne Harris. Guerrero, woohoo! All right, so I'm actually gonna respond to that question shortly, and then let's do generate. 
Number four, 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 who won? Oh my gosh. Number four, Valerie for the love of music. Yay, you are the winner. And let's do our last and final winner. 125, 125, who is our winner? Glue Gun Roses, you have won. Okay, I'm gonna answer these questions. Okay, so congratulations to our winners. Again, that is Glue Gun Roses, Yvonne and Harris Guerrero, Valerie for the love of music. Congratulations, you won. Slide in the DMs or send me an email. Now I'm going to answer their question that they asked. Just because like, there's a ton of questions. This freaking Q&A session video is gonna be pretty long because that's more than 100 questions. Well, some of them are duplicates, but I'm gonna avoid doing three questions at least by answering them now. Okay, so Valerie asks, do you like living alone or would you like to have a roommate? I enjoy living by myself. Um, roommate life was cool, but I'm, I'm over it. Glue Gun Roses asks, have you tried online dating? Yes, I have, a couple years ago. Did not work out. <laughs> it was fun, I will admit, but the guys on there are just kind of, I don't know how to, dis they're not, this is why I do not do online dating. They look good online, but in person, not only like look-wise, but like they make themselves sound very good on paper, of course, like a resume. But when you actually meet them, it's like, what? You're not talking, you're not, you know, a lot of people can like text all day, er day, message you all day, er day, but when they actually talk, no. They can't communicate and talk to you. Like, that's a huge problem. Like, I don't wanna be texting you all day getting to know you through text all day. I would rather talk, you know, face to face, things like that. So online dating did not work for me. And she also asked, funniest pickup line you heard. The funniest pickup line I heard was, somebody actually, this was just a couple weeks ago, someone used that um, hangover pickup line, which was, how much does a polar bear weigh? Answer, enough to break the ice, yeah. I knew that one, that was, a, that was a funny night, actually. He was a very interesting fella. Okay, next she asked, man, glue gun roses, you, you outdid yourself, girl. What's your missing home comfort food? Okay, my missing home comfort food, what do you mean, like comfort food? My missing home comfort food? Like, what would I make if I'm missing home, I guess? I, I don't know, I guess, fry bread, because, Almost all my Navajo friends make it and I make it, uh, yeah. What's your struggle food stories? Very little money and you make blank to eat and it's good. Um, this was probably happened a lot in college because for one, I had to ride the bus to Walmart and then ride the bus back to campus. So I only had to buy food that could fit in my backpack. Otherwise, I'm gonna be carrying all these groceries, you know, all this stuff, so I, I only, and I only went once a week, so, um, and of course I only, I had like a student worker job, and that's what I, you know, of course making that low of a money, I worked in a financial aid office at ASU on the Polytechnic campus, so maybe you see me there if you went to ASU at the Polytechnic campus. <laughs> I was there. From 2006 to 2010, I worked there. Struggle food, I would make, my mom always used to make this and I loved it and I could eat it for days and it lasted for days. White rice, tomatoes, and chicken. Those three things and put some salt in there. Oh, that was so good. Easy to make, so good, lasted a long time and I could eat it like every day. So that's my struggle food. Oh, alongside with like the noodles and stuff like that. Um, and then Yvonne and Harris asked, what's your clan? So my clan is Who are your favorite YouTubers? I have a lot of favorite YouTubers. Um, I'll have to go to my YouTube page. It's actually listed on my channel. I don't know if you guys can see 
the channels that I follow. It's, pu it's public on my end so I can see everything, but I don't know if you guys can. So um, a couple people that I watch right now that I enjoy, of course, Natalie Franklin, Life with the Walter Family, check them out. Sherry Lee, Mandy Wilson, What Would Kitty Do? Seaman Vlogger, Michael Balserico. I am Hope Lee. I just got into her videos and oh my gosh, love her. You guys have to check out her videos, her channel. Um, but yeah, just check it out under my channels. I hope it's listed as featured and all my subscriptions are there. So it's kind of like who I'm watching right now. Um, I haven't really had the chance to watch other people that I've been trying to um, follow and get to see their videos because it's just been recently that I started following them. But um, yeah, I'm always a supporter of other YouTubers, so if you have a YouTube channel, definitely let me know and I will check out your videos. What was the next question? What do you like about your new apartment? Just that it's quiet. I mean, I can actually hear my neighbors upstairs, but otherwise, compared to when I lived in Tempe, I, I love it. Like it's quiet, it's not as busy. Um, I love the area and it's closer to everything that I want to be around. Um, it's a little further from work, but that's fine. That's fine by me. Uh, otherwise, yeah. And that's basically it for all the questions that I'm going to answer right now. Stay tuned for the Q&A video. Congratulations once again to all the winners. And of course, thank you everybody who have subscribed to me and have been watching me daily, liking my videos commenting my videos I do enjoy and read every comment and try to reply if you know if you ask something or say something I try to reply to everybody thank you for watching today's videos I'm excited just want to say thank you to everybody for watching my videos for supporting me and for all the love you all have shown me guess that's it so I'll see you guys on the next video I have tons of ideas coming up for new videos I have special guests coming up and I'm excited. I'm excited. I hope you guys are excited. And again, thank you for watching my videos. And that's it. Okay. Well, I hope you guys have a good day. Okay. Bye.